<laughs> Yo, what's going on guys? So, um, I actually recorded this before. And of course, I can never get a recording right the first try, and it picked up my computer microphone. I didn't like the sound of it, so I just thought, you know what? I'm still playing Freedom Wars. Might as well just make another, um, another take. So, anyways, um, so yesterday, something happened, and it turns out that FTC, there's a, if there was a FTC complaint, Federal Trade Commission, charge to Sony, um, talking about misleading comments. Uh, oh yeah, I am uh, currently just doing some retributions. I'm just trying to get some entitlement points because I am currently making weapons. But uh, yeah, so anyways, um, yeah, there's an FTC complaint, and it turns out that um, because I was talking about misleading ads, and so the misleading ad basically was talking about how in the beginning of the Vita's life, they're talking about all these things that the Vita is going to be able to do, uh, basically regarding the PS3 because that's that's um. Uh, the PS3 is where it started off, and that's where they were, like, talking so much about it. All like, oh my god, this is going to be the greatest thing. Uh, so, the first thing was when, when they talk about, um... The, so, the, there's a couple complaints that they were talking about in this. I actually read the exact federal document, like, the document where, um, everything is, is like, talked about and whatnot. And in that document, it, uh, it has a couple points. Not too many points, but it has a couple. It, it just showing examples, basically. It doesn't, like, show every single point that, um, where they were misleading. But, uh, the, there was, like, about two or three main points, where the first one was saying, um, they are all, like, you will be able to remote play Killzone 3 seamlessly. Uh, they were talk all, talking all that stuff about being on a remote play Killzone 3 on the Vita from the PS3. From the PS3. Like, not, like, through... Places and now or anything else. They added. They, they started talking about. They over, they started overhyping places and now. Whenever um, they realized the PS3 was not optimized to fucking stream, which is really weird to me. Like, how do you just not know your system can do that? You should be able. To, you should be able to know that if it's gonna be able to do that from like the day one. You know, whenever you made the system. Um, so I, obviously they did not know that, and so that was a misleading comment, and so they're charged for that. Um, before, I'm, I was going to say this at the end, but I'll just say this now. Um, uh, with this, with all this happening, you will be able to get a, what's it called? A, you will be able to get a refund in the form of either $25 to spend to your liking, or $50, um, I think, PSN. I don't know exactly where this $50, it does, it does say something like specific. It, it clearly states that, okay, the $50 is going to be just spending on, um, uh, what's it called, Sony products, but it doesn't say exactly if you get, like, a, a good, uh, what's it called, just a straight up $50 for the PS, on your PSN account, you know, it doesn't really say that exactly, so I really don't know, but, um, yeah, uh, so, and another thing was saying how you could pause your game and be able to just play whenever you want and shit like that, they're all like, oh yeah, you'll be able to, um, play MLB The Show 12, you be able to play on your PS3, pause that shit, and just continue on your Vita. That was a misleading thing because you were not able to do that. It, act it actually says that if you want to do that, you'd have to completely end your whole, uh, your oh, you have to do the whole nine innings, I mean. Which doesn't make sense to me. I, d I never played MLB The Show, so I didn't know. But that that's, that's what they say. So I was just like, wow. Uh, so, it was, uh, so yeah, that, that was another claim. And, um, yeah. It's weird, honestly, it's really weird, uh, because what I see is fucking, like, the Vita has been out for almost, almost three years now, almost three, it'll be three, um, in February 2015, I pre yeah, February 2015, um, and the fact that this is happening now is just really boggles my mind, like, I don't know where it came from. Like, why is this just happening now? Why did this not happen a year into his life or something like that? But nope, it's just like, oh, we're gonna do this shit now. But it's whatever, you know? And I don't know if this is a good thing or a bad thing. I can't really put my my finger on it. Like, is this good? I feel like it's not good mainly because, of course, Sony's losing money from, for the Vita now. Uh, not only do they not make much money, then now they're losing some of it. So it's just like, damn, oh, you guys really fucked up. And it's good because, oh, I'm getting fucking money, you know what I mean? I'm trying to get Little Planet 3, and with this, I might be able to get it. If the $50 is indeed just, like, a basically getting a $50 PSN card, then, 
a PSV, or I mean, uh, Little Plan 3 will be mine. Will be fucking mine. Just wait on it. Um, and then, uh, that's so, yeah, I really don't know. And then, uh, it's really hard to concentrate and talk. I'm sorry. I, I recorded this before I was doing a, such a less, a less thinking mission. And I was able to talk. But, uh, yeah, oh yeah, so, um, it says that you'll be able to get this refund if you got this system, um, after June 1st. So, or before June 1st, 2000, 2012. Or, yeah, before June 1st, 2012. So I got the game February 15th. I got it a week before it was the officially released in the US. So if I do not get an email, you better believe I'm gonna get pissed. You better believe that shit. There's no reason why I should not get that. Because like first edition uh, bundles should be able to um they should they they're like there's no way they can mistake it. Of course we got it before then. Uh, what what I, what what I'm thinking is um what they're gonna do is they're gonna see whenever they you first like signed on to your PSN like you first connected your account to the Vita because I know connecting your account to the Vita does some different shit. So you know that's what I think though because uh, I don't know how else they can figure out who when you got the system because I if the, I'm telling you if I don't get that shit I will take a picture of my uh, what's it called. My receipt. Email. Call those fuckers up. Email that shit to them. Say, give me my 50 bucks. I don't even know if I have my receipt anymore. I do have my case, though. My first season bundle. So, I can go ahead and take the picture of that shit. There's no... Like, obviously... Um... They'll see that shit. Like, no, no. There's no way that they can be like, oh, you didn't get... Bro. First season bundle. Get the fuck out. So, yeah. I don't even need my receipt. I'll just go ahead and, uh... Just take a picture of whatever of my first season bundle and send it to him. I will tweet, I'm, you think I'm kidding too. I will dead ass em or tweet it to him and say, give me some fucking money. I'm selfish like that, I mean, come on, come on. Money is money. As much as I don't want to hurt their sales, I mean, it's like, come on now. You, 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 they already hurt the sales, like it doesn't even make a difference. Oh, I don't want to use that. But uh, yeah, I, I can't collect my thoughts as well in this video, I'm sorry. But either way, basically, the, to sum it up, they um they they're getting sued, I guess you could call it, and for having misleading ads about the PlayStation Vita connecting with the PlayStation 3. Basically, I feel like they didn't anticipate this shit to not work, and so they were all they're typing it all up and shit, and then all of a sudden it didn't work, and they getting caught now. They're finally getting caught. Two years later, it bites them in the ass, which doesn't make sense to me, honestly. But um. Uh, yeah, it's crazy, honestly. I think it's crazy how, like I said before, it's happening now, you know what I mean? Like, this is two years after, almost three, after the system fucking comes out, and just now they're getting sued for it. Because uh, after a year, a year after the uh, Vita came out, they could have, like, it was misleading already, you know what I mean? Like, we found out it didn't work. I'll, although, I do think that they did say, oh, it's going to work soon. Like, they said the games were going to work soon. And they never did work. Another thing is, um, they did uh, mention that they in their ads they all they also did say that every game, almost almost every game is gonna be available for remote play. And I can tell you what, almost no games are available for remote play on the PS3. So that, that it's it's crazy, it's crazy. Where's my assessor? She's right there. Um, but uh, yeah, so it's crazy, man. I really don't know like what they're gonna do. Um, I have not gotten an email yet. I did check to see if I do get an email. I'll be sure to you know um, What's it called? Let's uh, yeah, make a video of what it looks like so you guys can see and easily check if you got it I'm gonna be like camping my my email now seriously Good I need to buy me so. But I'm just gonna be like camping. Fuck I didn't get him Bind him bind him Come on! I'm trying to get the headpiece. She does not bind him soon. I'm gonna get pissed. Is it incoming or is it not? Ants, like, do something. Fuck, now I'm dead. Uh, yeah. Uh, so yeah, like I said, I read the real document, so I saw everything that it said and whatnot. And it, it I think it's crazy, honestly. How, how this is all happening, how it's all going on. But, um, 
So let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think this is good? Are you guys happy? Are you guys sad? Like, what, what are your thoughts on it? Honestly, I'm a little mad. I'm a little sad. I'm a little happy. You know, I'm have, I got mixed feelings right now. Because one, Vita's getting hurt more. Two, I'm getting money. And three, oh yeah, I forgot to say this. Something that really just, really, um, just confusing me is this, if this is not a, um, what you would call it? If this isn't like a suing case and just, it just got brought up all of a sudden, that doesn't make any sense to me. Because, like, how can you take a dead system like the Vita and all of a sudden you just worry about it? Or you get mad that you, you know, they just start bringing up the topic of it. You know what I mean? So, like, it had to be someone that sued it. Someone had to sue it. Because uh, it wouldn't make it. I feel like this wouldn't make any other sense otherwise. So, I'm trying to break this head. Is this guy dead? No. I'm going for a drag down. Fucking drag him down. You guys keep... Fuck, nah, they're doing, they're saying misleading things. I was waiting for a whatever. I never got a binding thing. I'm gonna fuck his head up. I'm gonna attach on. Okay. Get the fuck away from me. Alright, let's just drag it down. Uh, yeah, I'll put all the links in the description so you can read it yourself. The IGN ad, the, um... Whatchamacallit? Fuck. Fuck! The IGN ad, I'll give you a link for the real document so you can read that too. You can get all the information for yourself. I just thought I'd, you know, give you guys the initial information. And I know I I know I poorly explained it. I'm sorry, but I I'm like really concentrated right now. That's why I did it in such a in a less um, requiring mission first because I knew I wanted to talk and it was easier. But then I was like, shit, I need to redo it because it sounded bad. Ah. Uh. Fuck, I know I did, I feel like I didn't talk about something. I know, so, yeah, the Killzone, they lied about have, being able to play Killzone Remote Play. Uh, they lied about being able to just pause your game on PS3 and continue on your PS4. They lied about that. Um, what else? What else is there? Uh, there's a few things I can't think of right now. So another tip is pick up weapons in retribution missions like this because they might have power up XLs and power up XLs are hard to get and they're really 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 neat. So pick that shit up. If I don't break this head on someone might die on dead ass too. Drag this bitch down. Ugh. So yeah, they, they did not um I don't think they sent out emails yet. But like I said, when I if if I get one if I don't, I will, I'm legit gonna take a picture, like, if I'm supposed to get money, I'm gonna get the money, you feel me? Like, it's not that, it's not that I wanna hurt the Vita, but if they're saying that I should be getting money, I'm gonna get money, you know what I mean? So, if I don't get an email, and I see people getting emails, I will literally call them, take a picture of my first digital bundle and say, tell me I didn't get this before June 1st, huh? Tell me I didn't get this before June 1st. How did I not get a headpiece yet? Or did I get it and I missed it? I've been absolutely destroying his head right now. I have not hit anything else but the head. Thank you for this. Of course, now you hit it when I'm almost out of game now. Give me this fucking head. I didn't get the headpiece. I don't think I did. His head was absolutely fucked. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. I got one of them, so I can upgrade once. But, uh, yeah, that's gonna be it. Um, all the ads, all the hyping up they did, they fucked up because they didn't follow up with it. So, yeah. Um, anyway, I'm gonna see you guys later. Uh, like I said, all the links will be in the description so you can get a better understanding of it. I just thought I'd bring up the, you know, the topic so you guys can, like, you know, hear about it. Uh, but, yeah, I will see you guys in another video.